hello hello how are you i am back again it's sunday morning john has got married so i figured i've got like 10 minutes to do a quick unboxing and i thought i would show you what's inside my latest in beauty box as you probably know if you've watched any of my videos i love 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 latest in beauty i think they are just like incredible value they give you so much bang for your buck they have a mix of luxury a mix of high street things that you want, things that you need, makeup, beauty, all sorts. It's like a real mix of skincare, body care, makeup. It's like, it's so good. It's so good. Anyway, I thought I would show you what I've got this month. I'm really excited. So let's just dive in. I'm gonna try and do this video fairly quickly because we all got stuff to do. And um, yeah, it's only a matter of time before Mary comes barging in. Whew, so I'm gonna start with probably the most like expensive items and this is actually a bit of like a doubling up if i'm honest so i'm going to show you the two of them together this is <laughs> i'm so embarrassed i got two of these basically this month latest in beauty have got vitabiotics and they have regular cbd and they've got cbd with added vitamin d most people would probably just get one but i'm wild so I got two. So I got the regular and the vitamin D version. They're both around, I wanna say they're around 35 pounds each. So these two products alone are worth like 70, maybe a bit more, maybe a bit less. So I'm getting a lot of bang for my buck already, but also I'm gonna be like a real chilled out mofo. Do you know what I mean? It's like, I am gonna be chilled out. I'm gonna drink lots of water. I'm gonna be hydrated, I'm gonna have a nap. And I'm gonna just be like one of those chilled out hipster mums. You know what I mean? I'm all in. I'm no longer like breastfeeding. I can do this. So yeah, there we have CBD, Vitabiotics. Very excited. High value product. I thought I'd just like start with it. You know, start with a big old bang. Next, I'm gonna go for Bedroom Hair by Kevin Murphy. I am so excited. I bloody love Kevin Murphy hair care. Have I shown that the right way around? There we go. Um, I love Kevin Murphy hair care. It is so good. He's an Australian brand. Um, he does like amazing hair care. It's very expensive. You only normally get it in salons, but it's so good, but it's so expensive. And I was quite shocked when I saw it in the latest in beauty edit. So I was like, I'm gonna get that. This is a nice big can. It's a texturizing hair care. Um, it's like a hairspray. And yeah, I figured it might like control and give my hair a bit of shape and if I do some styling I might keep it in place and this is a hundred mil can so yeah I think that's like almost full size I'm not sure but I'm pretty excited so that is my next item and I'm very thrilled you know when you're like hello Kevin Murphy I hope we get more Kevin Murphy in the future I hope we get the shampoo the conditioner they've got a lot of amazing products but I'm hoping that we'll start to see a little bit more Kevin Murphy but who knows anyway that is the next item then I got a brow product because I needed more brow products and this is Wonder Brow. Wonder with a U, so it's like Wonder. Am I saying that right? Wonder Brow. I think that's Wonder Boo. I don't know. I feel like it's a pun, but I can't quite work out what the pun is. Maybe that's just me being a bit dim. Um, but this is a refillable micro angled brow pencil. It's in shade blonde. There was also a brunette, which I was tempted for because I like a dark brow. But then I thought, do you know what? It's gonna be too dark for me. So I thought I'd give this a go. Um, there's a lot of hype around this brand. So I was like, do you know what? I'm gonna give it a go. Yeah, so you've got a little brow comb at one end. Whoop. And then you've got a little brow pencil-y thing at the other end. But I will give this a go. I'll let you know how I get on. Sorry, I've not got a huge amount to say because I've never tried it, but I'm like, yeah, I need some brow action. I feel like now I'm like a mum, um, I don't have much time for makeup. So today, for instance, I've got a little bit of like a blusher bronzer thing. I just swiped across my cheeks. I've got brows on, I've got eyeliner, no eyeshadow, no mascara, um, a tiny little bit of lipstick, no foundation, no concealer. That's why I look a bit like ropey, <laughs> but what are you gonna do? Um, but I do feel like now that I'm not really wearing much makeup, I'm like, brows are important. Brows, lips, but like that is my main staple. So um, yeah, I thought I'd give that a product a go. Anyway, um, next thing I've got, I've got Mitchum. Love, love, love Mitchum, huge fan. I would recommend to anybody who is a little bit anxious and get a bit sweaty. If you've got a sweaty teenager and you need a better deodorant, try Mitchum. And also if you are going to like a long day, like a wedding, 
I would say definitely try Mitchum. It is really good. It's really long lasting. It's really, really, really effective. It's kind of formulated for like sweaty people, which I'm into because I am a sweaty person. Um, and also like if you're wearing like a dry clean only dress and you don't want to dry clean it every single wear, I would say try Mitchum because it's like, it's really good. It really works. Um, I think that's actually from the men's range because it's amber and sandalwood, but I don't care um, because I was like, I need deodorant, do you know what I mean? And it's like, it's Mitchum, I'm gonna buy it. Um, so this, yeah, this is Amber and Sandalwood. It's a gel cream, which I haven't actually tried before. I think it might be new, but I figured, you know what? It's all the same, it's all the same. Let's just get the men's because I need deodorant. So that is my next thing. And I would highly recommend Mitchum if you are a little bit sweaty or if you've got a long day, if you're a little bit anxiety filled, or if you just wanna cut down on your dry cleaning bill. So good. Anyway, next product is, I think this is actually the last thing. It is. Okay, next product, last product, is Yardley Fig Leaf and Juniper. This is a moisturizing hand wash. I have used it before, it's absolutely lovely. It smells very green, because you know, Juniper's greeny. Fig Leaf, greeny, but it's very pretty. It's very soft, it's very subtle. It's almost a bit apple -y. It's very pretty. Anyway, um, this is a really nice big bottle. Yardley products are lovely um, and I just really like the scent. I really like the huge quantity you get. I needed hand wash, let's be real. I needed hand wash, I needed deodorant and I figured why, why put them into my Asda shopping cart when I can get them in latest in beauty and get better stuff, you know? No Carex for me this month. I'm Yardley, baby. Anyway, that is my, my selection. I'm excited about being a chilled out B. I am excited about potentially having nicer hair and I'm excited to not be sweaty or have dirty hands. So um, yeah, good box if you ask me. If you aren't signed up to Latest of Beauty yet, I hugely, hugely, highly, highly recommend it. It is such a good beauty box. It's great value and um, yeah, I'm just a big fan. I get it every month. I've been a subscriber for about, I wanna say like four years now. It's been a sweet time, might even be more. The time is going by quickly. But yeah, I've been a subscriber for years. I love, love, love it. It's such a good beauty box. And um, yeah, big fan, big fan. Anyway, that's my content this month and I'm gonna go and be zen now. Actually, no, I'm gonna have a coffee, then I'm gonna be zen. You know what I mean? Anyway, um, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again soon, goodbye.